April Sanchez is going through more grief than any mother should. Five years ago, her baby boy was murdered. The child's father pled guilty to the crime. In her son's memory, April recently had the baby's ashes made into a beautiful memorial. When the starfish arrived at her home a few weeks ago... They told the post postal worker they were a relative of mine and they signed for the package. The thief took off with the baby's ashes. After we aired April's story, hundreds of you shared it on social media, trying to help her track down the ashes and the thief. The U.S. Post Office began investigating too. Then this Sunday, April got a text from someone claiming to have the starfish. I don't know how they found my number. The number of the texter was from out of state, California. They wanted money up front. 30 bucks. I just think they wanted the money like Western Union and then that was it. Then the texter said they wanted 30 more once they delivered the starfish. April asked them to show a photo of the starfish. They didn't. And they said, sorry, yeah. you were parted stolen. Then the texter said, unless I have at least 20 bucks, I will not meet. April thought it was a scam. Investigators with the Postal Service do too. Okay, here's why a spokesman for the Postal Service says the sender refused to send proof of possession. The sender refused to transfer the item without an upfront payment. Classic signs, they say, of a scam. April is still trying to find her baby's ashes. For Target 7, I'm Nancy Laughlin. As far as the woman who signed for the starfish last month claiming to be April's sister, postal inspectors say they have a person of interest. They still have not located the package.